Hey everyone, and welcome to Cooking Companion TV. I'm Jenna Edwards, and this is a roundup of my favorite recipe books. When I search for recipes for the channel, I try to find dishes that use easy to find ingredients that translate across the globe and that avoid a lot of dairy or provide easy substitutes and that are generally helpful. I also try to focus on vegetables because no matter how you diet, we can all use more vegetables in our life. There are a few recipe sources that I return to frequently, including for my own everyday inspiration outside of YouTube content. First, Michael Ruhlman, Ruhlman's 20. Ruhlman is a journalist who applied the journalistic approach to cooking. He decided that if you could master 20 basic techniques, you can cook anything. So in the book, he breaks down the function of various ingredients like onions or salt or water and the role they play. He also explains the science behind techniques like making dough and batter and how that understanding can help you translate baking lingo. With each chapter, he includes a few recipes to demonstrate the explanation so you get to practice what you just learned. I expect it's a recipe book that I will never get rid of since it has so much helpful information. Second, America's Test Kitchen Family Edition. I think this is the first cookbook I ever received. I had a roommate who loved to cook and bake. He was my first experience with someone who cooked without recipes and nearly every weekend he would bake something from this cookbook. It's full of helpful tips from the test kitchen. They're great at explaining why they recommend a specific ingredient or a specific technique. This isn't a healthy cookbook by any means. They do publish something like that specifically, but when I'm researching a great technique, I always look at this one. Third, The New Vegetarian Cooking for Everyone by Deborah Madison. It's a huge book and it's full of approachable recipes for veg vegetable centric dishes and meals. I have a dedicated playlist on YouTube of recipes from this cookbook. She does rely on cream a fair amount, which I try to avoid, but usually she'll direct you to substitutions or when you can omit the cream. A lot of the recipes remind me of like older classic dishes, something you might've seen decades ago. She uses herbs like tarragon and marjoram and it's like, who uses that anymore? But there's plenty of inspiration for humble ingredients and you'll renew your fascination for vegetables you thought you didn't like anymore. Fourth, the New York Times cooking app. For $40 a year, you can access a seemingly unending treasure trove of vetted recipes. They've got a great team of recipe developers and editors, and they're producing even more video content, especially around techniques to help you become a better cook. Melissa Clark is a major contributor to the app and she has her own cookbooks. I have Dinner, which I've enjoyed for myself, although I don't use it a lot for YouTube content. Nearly everything of hers that I've made has been really wonderful. I also use Instagram by following the hashtag Tahini. So I see any posts with that tag. It's exposed me to a number of obscure recipes or cultural food traditions that I'd otherwise never see. So if there's an ingredient that you want to learn more about, that's a great way to see what others are doing with it. There are so many great recipe books out there, and these are the ones that I turn to regularly or that I've gotten a lot of reliable recipes from. And I recommend these specific ones to keep in your home if you're looking to build your recipe book repertoire. I try not to have a lot of cookbooks around. I don't see the point in keeping a book when I'm only going to use one or two recipes from it. But these are my classics. I've got links to purchase the books in the video description below or at cookingcompaniontv.com slash cookbooks. They are affiliate links, so I may receive an affiliate fee if you purchase them through that link. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it and subscribe to this channel for more recipe dem demos. I'm Jenna Edwards and thanks for watching.